Keep your eyes on me. What's going on, guys? It is Welsh Dragon DSG here. Welcome back to Season 2 with the Blackburn Rovers career mode on FIFA 17. Last episode, we had quite a lot going on. We won the Community Shield against Manchester City. We also put in a few transfer offers and stuff like that. We signed one or two players. For example, a little recap on who we've brought in so far. We brought in Locoretti. We have... We've also brought in more as well. I'm sure we brought in someone else. Uh, we haven't brought in anyone else. Oh, we've brought in Sam Gallagher as well on loan. But we have got a few players out injured. Burn is out injured. Gardner's out injured. So those players will be slowly coming back into the side. But in the last few episodes, I have asked you guys, can you suggest a right back, a right mid, and a left back for our team for replacement roles? And that's what I'm going to be looking at in the further on in the episode today. But guys, make sure you check out Loot Crate. You get yourself a monthly box full of gaming uh, items. It could be like figurines, it could be console related stuff, it could be anything. So check out Loot Crate, use my discount code and you get that there. It's pretty awesome. So <laughs> we're one of the last games to actually play. We are playing on the Monday. We're Monday Night Football. And we got three games for you today. we got Leicester City, we got Watford. And we do have Plymouth Argyle. We might play the Manchester United game. I think we might play the Manchester United game and do a transfer deadline day special um, in that. So we got all going on today in episode three of the Blackman Rovers career mode. This is the side we're going out with in our first game. Tammy Abraham, McCartan, Look Ready, Roas, Lowe, Conway, Declan John, Oxford, Mulgrew, Emmanuel, and then our brand new goalkeeper, Sil Sivla, in the set number one position. So guys, make sure you hit that like button. Do not forget to subscribe. And let's jump in against Leicester, who we beat in the FA Cup final. The Premier League. This is City vs. Blackburn Rovers. I had to put this in yet. It's the new graphics. For now, we're in the actual Premier League. It looks absolutely brilliant. Um, nice little change to what we've been having at the... Um, in the championship. Let's get forward to the size. We're going to have a quick look at our lineup or Leicester City's lineup. He was first, obviously, former Premier League champions. Manchester City did win it last season. But we've got a new player. Look at he's there, looking good, looking swanky for Blackburn Rovers. There, new player. He should be able to slip in quite well. He played well against Manchester City, without a doubt. You cannot deny that. He did very, very well against the Premier League champions. McCartney up front. One of you guys just commented on my latest videos. I say thank you very much. All the support's been absolutely amazing. Griffith's debut in the Premier League. <laughs> Ooh. There's been talks as well, guys, that there is potential of Venky selling at Blackburn Rovers. Will that happen? We'll find out. But anyway, that's Less City side. We only want to have a quick look at that. And we're going to jump into the game now. Mares will kick off. Let's go. Let's see what we can do. Arnold. Oh, good play from Marco Roas. Is he going to excel in the Premier League? It's Tommy Abraham. Good save by the goalkeeper. Eight minutes in. Good save from Castro Smichael. What a player. What a player. They are inside. The crowd is absolutely immense. Shane McCartan making his Premier League debut. It's a good save by the goalkeeper. Castro Smichael keeping him in the game once again. Oh, what a save. Like, keep have it the same what a goal down the line to Craig Conway Craig Conway making his Premier League debut as well oh it's a good save from the goalkeeper once again one of our signature moves from left to right and it was so close there good save coming forward with some danger Tammy Abraham football to Roas Marco Roas scores he scores he did it yes he scores on his Premier League debut Marcus Roas didn't actually score last season for us. And then scores on his debut with a brilliant run. Marco Roa scores for Blackburn Rovers right on the half. Our number seven are oh, absolutely brilliant. Oh, and so chef. That's my main man. What a goal. So we have made substitution, two debuts, Tammy Abraham, Shane McCartan going off, we we got Moore and Gallagher coming on, so a second debut for Blackman Rovers, Sam Gallagher, 
Um, hopefully, this new player as well. Moore, see if he can make an impact in the last 20 minutes. Grew that cross. Moore turns. Moore saved. Oh, oh, good chance from our new player. We have won our first game in the Premier League, beating Leicester 1-0 with a Marco Rojas goal. Without a doubt, didn't expect that. And it was quite an even game throughout the entire thing. But Moore, who came on as a sub, making that made an absolute brilliant impact he didn't score but he had two chances straight away but Marta Roas one shot one goal good start to his Premier League debut so some good news Gary Garner's looking to come back but we won't be playing him just yet I think we're gonna wait a little bit and plus the way we played we played quite well so Dom particularly want to be changing anything at the moment but I'm gonna have a quick look at my short list to who I've actually got in there it's only Samuelson right Samba can go I'm removing from my shortlist. Renato can go as well. We'll leave Samuelson in there for now. I'm gonna, what I'm going to do, I'm going to make the shortlist of the, some of the players you guys suggested. And we'll see who we can sign. Just make sure you keep suggesting right bats, right mids and stuff like that, guys. Okay, guys. So I've created a shortlist of a few players you guys suggested. And also a few players that I had in my mind recently. So I think there's about three or four of mine. And the rest are actually yours from comments from last season and recently and stuff so i'm kind of stuck to the root of the right back the left back the right mid position and marcus edwards was a random cam that we looked at as well so we have a lot of inquiries in we haven't put any bids in just yet so we are looking at connor roberts from swansea city uh if uh, i think it's Orfa, i don't know how you pronounce his name but, but we call him dominic from uh wells so right back position Bree from barnes in the right back position Left back now, we're going at the Hendricks from uh, by Leverkusen. He's quite a young, talented player. Matt Target, Rico Henry, very um, good potential on 81 rated. Um, Samuel as well, we still have there. Oliver Burke is a, quite a player who's been talked about quite a lot in the news. I picked him personally because in real life, he's one of the most valued Scotsmen or something like that, who's went to uh, Red Bull Leverkusen, I think it is. I can't remember um, what team it was. And then we got Marcus Edwards from uh, Tottenham Hotspur. One of you guys actually suggested see if we should consider signing him. I thought he was a right mid, so I'm not too sure if I will end up signing him or not. It is a bit of a big ass whether we, whether we actually want him in our team or not. But we are going to be going at this game against Watford to see if we get any money, um, any inquiries back and stuff like that. Submission dead. Oh, here we go. Uh, Hendrix is only 2 million, which is nice. So if I'm going to offer... I'm going to go in with 1.2 million to start off with and just see if they're set because he got 15 grand ways, which is quite a big budget. we got Marcus Edwards. He's only a million. It could be definitely worth um, we end up trying to sign this guy. And am offer 500 grand to see if we half the price, get a bit more depth, and we'll sell one or two players. Connor Roberts. He's only 600 grand. He could be a very good replacement um, player for us. You can say 300 grand. Uh, Future first team player, only 21 years old, so could do pretty well for us. 4.7 million for Dominic. Honestly, we're not going to be able to sign. I'm going to offer him two. He's got one year left on his contract. There's no reason why we can't get him for two, but he's got quite a high wage at 22 grand. Matt Target is around 2.4 million. I'm going to offer him around 1.4 million, see if we get any with him. Um, so the left back seems to be a bit of the. The side, the, the side of our team which could be our weakness at the moment. Because um, we do have one replacement. Oliver Burke, 4.1 million. Eight and a grand for Bree. Rico as well. Henry. This guy's a left back and he could be a player that we bring in. He's going to be on cheap waste. 12 grand as well. We'll offer him 1.2 million just so they're interested. And we'll consider see if we can actually sign these players. But... Bree James is another one as well. He's got pretty decent potential. We're going to offer 500 grand for this player. Um, actually, we're going to offer four. We're going to half the budget near enough. A little more than half. But we're going to see what we can do. He's only on 900 quid a week. Burke as well. That's a big chunk of our budget if we do. Squad rotation player as well. We're going to have to consider selling a few players, which is what I'm going to do now, actually. I'm going to have a look and see what players we can actually sell. 3 million quite potentially they do end up accepting it. Um, and we just go to transfers and let's just sell some players for a moment. Let's have a look at the positions. We need to do it on positions. Uh, so we can't sell any goalkeepers. Centre backs we can't sell. Left backs we could sell. Doyle, if I'm truthfully honest. Um, his contract. 
can offer him a new contract. His contract's running out. Um, he wants 2,500, so I'll offer him that. Um, he's just going to be a Spodrick first team player. He doesn't play that often. We'll offer him that, and then we'll be able to sell him. Emmanuel and Nagby, we're not, he's on loan, so we, we definitely don't have a right back. And then we got CDM, we got Garner, we don't sell him. Burn, we don't really want to sell. We want to keep him in our team. Bell is a youth player, which I want to put out on loan. So I'm going to at least put you out on loan. Um, Evans, I'm going to sell. I'm actually going to add to the transfer list. I'm happy enough going to sell Evans. Lehman, he is out on loan. Look at it, we just bought in. Tomlinson, he's out on loan. Watson as well, he can go out on loan from our team because we've only just brought him in. And Lola, he's out on loan as well. He's worth 500 grand. Liam Feeney, oh, do I sell Liam Feeney? Do I really want him? I'm going to add the transfer list. His contract's expiring. We'll try and get rid of him. And strikers, we've got to leave the same. We can't really sell many players, which is a big, big issue. But anyway, guys, let's jump into our next game against Watford. And I'm going to get... I'm going to... Actually, I'm going to leave the side the same. But... Yeah, we're going to put Arnold on over Conway. We're going to leave the side the exact same. And if we need to make changes, we'll, start, we'll bring more on again as a substitution. First home game of our Premier League campaign. Through ball out to Tammy Abraham. What can he do with it? Comes across, McCartan! Goal! McCartan gets his first goal in the Premier League. Great goal! Great play. Oh, broken open to say the least. Absolutely brilliant. This is amazing. McCartan is my new Solazano. That's who he is. What a player. First goal in the Premier League in his second. It's arriving in the middle. And Rovers have got a corner now. Brooklyn. Who's that? Oh, it's come off the bar by Arnold. Maybe disappointed with the way he's given the ball away. And there's the interception. Oh, more. More. Oh, more. Almost scoring again. What an impact this guy made. More. Good save for the goalkeeper. Oh, my God. I can't believe it more. It just doesn't score. One, a second game in the Premier League. Another 1 0 victory. A very close game once again. But Shane McCartan getting a goal today on his second game in the Premier League. More, in all seriousness, when is this guy going to score? He comes on as a sub and he at least gets two chances within 10 minutes. When will he score? Do we start him? I don't know. I think we were starting against Plymouth Argyle when we simply. Okay, of course. When we went in that game, we went. We did a lot of offers. Target. They do want to put 2.6 million. We are, we're going to be very stingy with our money. We're going to keep offering a little bit more, a little bit more. Wells was rejected. The sum's too low. And I can't remember how much he was actually worth now. 2 million. Estimated transfer fee. And they want. I'll offer them the two to see if they'll set. Don't know if they will. Manuel's playing really well. Leverkusen and set though they have got the price tag on him of uh, two million. We'll offer 1.5 million to see what happens. Uh, 500 grand below what they want, but it would be a cracking uh, replacement left back that we could bring in, and then two very strong players down that our left hand side. Uh, but then we've got any more coming in. Uh, Burke has been accepted for three million, which is going to be an absolute cracking signing. 20 grand wage, or which is a Big ask for us. I'm going to put him as an important first team player and we're going to see if he'll set or not. That's going to be a big ask for us to try and accommodate that. If you're increasing your offer, we take it in consideration. Oh, I don't know. We need to keep it quite low key. 900 grand. I don't think we want to be spending that much on him. Brentford, unacceptable. 2.2 million. Let's offer 1,500 quid for him. He's, we don't. We need to be very tight with our money. Um, and a set of 600 grand bid rejected. Oh, I don't. Spurs, honestly. 400 grand. He's kind of our back at back at right back. So like, if we don't get our main one, we can get this guy. Spurs transfer offer too low. How much did I offer? An estimated fee, 500 grand. 
700,000. We'll offer that. We'll see. <laughs> 700,000 for the Marcus Edwards is going to be an absolute steal, if I'm truthfully honest. But anyway, right. What are we going to do? We're going to sim our next game against uh, Plymouth Argyle. Um, and we are going to start. I might put more on and have him start. I'm not too sure. Are we going to see? Um, actually, our side's looking quite strong, to be fair. Ooh, we'll leave it as it is. We'll leave it as it is. We will. Okay, so I'm going to be seeing this game. We have changed side a little bit. We are, I decided to start more on Gardner just to see mm, whether it'll make any difference or not uh, to our team. See if they can play well. And obviously, I did want to start more. And we do end up winning 2 0. More didn't actually score, but Detlin John and Abraham, and hopefully. That doesn't mean an escalated injury. It is. It's an escalated injury for Gardner. He just got off injury Champions as well. Cup. That's the worst Into thing. That means he's done it again. Before we do anything else, I need to go English down to AFC player suspended. Nil. Jack Dawes accepted the contract. Press Barnsley. conference. Nil. Leverkusen Barry. accepted One. the offer for our left back. back. 15 grand. Four years. Newport County, one. And we're going to put him down Bradford as an important City, first team two. player. Just see if he accepts. The contract. United, Spurs one. have accepted the Marcus um, Edwards offer six grand two. he only wants. So I'm going to him five to see if he'll set. If he doesn't, Burnley, oh one. well. Um, but I think he's going to be, he's going to be a good replacement. Uh, unacceptable Edwards, Connor Roberts even, I should say. I'm not like paying stupid money for you. You're essentially a backup, backup, right back player. Off reject, we're not going to be able to sign in by the looks. Target has been accepted. Wow, 20 grand wage for that. I don't know if I want it for 20 grand wage. I don't think I do. I prefer to go for someone else. Brentford, for example, this player that I'm after now, he's only on 12 grand wage. And I think I'm willing to like pay that a little bit more. But 500 grand above what? They want below below what they want. Barnsley, oh, this right back position is getting on my nerves. Six hundred grand. That's like two grand below what they want. Nine hundred pound wage. That's gonna be massive for us. Oliver Burke as a set did. See, I'm gonna stall that for a minute, just because. Can we can sign two more? We need two more players when we sign that, and I won't be able to afford everyone. We're just going to store that for a moment. Um, there has been talks about financial takeover and stuff like that. Don't know whether I should do it. But, oh, we're going up against Manchester United next as well. And we could sign. Do I, t I think, oh, you know what? I want Burke and I'm going to sign him. We've got, we got loads of offers coming in. 600 grand, that's been a set did. He's only on 900 pounds as well. So, I'm just going to offer him a grand. And you're going to be an important first team player. He's got quite good potential. I think he's got like up to 80 or potential 81, something like that. So, Brentford has accepted as well, which is good. Lots of bids and stuff coming in. I'm not offering you any more um, to that, if I'm honest. I'm not doing any more than 12 grand. You're not having 15 for coming to me. Uh, Target, not going to accept you. Roberts, you've been accepted. You're my backup one, so I kind of have to take consideration of actually like how much I want to give you so we need to keep the offers going uh, Marcus has been reviewed Hendricks has accepted oh my god mm. Hendricks or Henry I'm going to stall I'm going to have to stall him target I'm going to reject target his wage is just way too much um, and then the other one is Burke. We're going to stall you as well. We need to find some money somehow. Match rescheduled, match rescheduled. Three matches rescheduled. Wow. All loads of matches rescheduled. Wow. <laughs> loads of matches rescheduled. But ooh, I'm, I'm in a bit of a difficult situation because... And we haven't got much budget. And Henry, they, they're not giving us any money. Like, we've earned that much. But our transfer budget, they're not, they're not giving us nothing. We've got people going on big wages. That's the problem. It's a big wages. Okay. Right. 
I'm trying to think. The biggest position I need improved in is my right back and my left back. So I'm going to wait for a minute because we can do it this all in like a transfer deadline special or something like that. Just see if people come back to us. And we're going to have a proper good look whether we set players and stuff like that. Jack Breeze accepted the contract. Henrique's counter offer. Roberts has accepted. So, well, he wants a 15 grand. I'll offer him the 15. And he can be an important first team player. But then, <laughs> Enrique's a big wage. That other guy's on 15 as well. Um, what we'll do, we'll wait now until we play this Manchester United game before we make any decisions. Like, we go to set now. And what we'll do, we'll go into a special video and we'll have like proper good luck and be like, okay, this is what we want to do. We're gonna change. We're gonna change the side route. Marcus Ross has to be dropped. We're gonna play Conway. Um, Moore's gonna start, and we're gonna put McCartan on. Actually, we're gonna put Gallagher on. We are against Manchester United. We changed our strike force. We have changed our strike force. We're not starting McCartan. We're gonna change it round. I think Moore deserves to start. I think. It might be a risky move. Maybe it's too early and it's against Manchester United. Um, but we'll see. We'll see what we can do. Let's jump into this game. Henrik Mkhitaryan. Oh, we've conceded Marcus Rashford. Whoa. Marcus Rashford. Oh my god. That was disappointing. Especially far post. You couldn't that was very, very accurate that was. Be a Mulgrew and Oxford and the goalkeeper, 1-0 down. We was on the attack. And literally, he just said three minutes out of time. And then all of a sudden, the whistle's blowing. The whistle's blowing. Damn it. First loss in the Premier League is against Manchester United. First loss of the season after four games. And to be fair... We didn't play well at all. And honestly, I don't think Moore is ready to start. I don't think Moore is ready to start. He's going to have to go drop that back down to the bench. Shane McCartan will come back on with Tammy Abraham. And we'll be seeing what we can do with this side next time out. Okay, so after the first three games in the Premier League, we have lost our first game. But we win two. We've beaten Leicester, we've beaten Watford. In all fairness, like losing to Manchester United was like expected, you could say. We've only conceded one goal this season, two clean sheets, in all fairness. So we've done pretty well. We are currently in sixth place, so very good start. But we did play the likes of Watford and Leicester. And Leicester are currently in 11th and Watford are currently in 4th. So, actually, Watford are doing pretty well. They were their only first loss as well, which was against us. So, hopefully, we can pick up a bit more momentum next uh, episode. Because next episode, we will be playing West Ham. And we're back in the Euro League. We're in the Euro League as well. So, it's going to be interesting to see how we do in the Euro League. We need to try and bring in as many players as we can in the next four days which is going to be happening next episode guys so in episode five you're going to be seeing all this all that it's going to be amazing so guys i want to say thanks for watching my name is wild shen yes chief make sure you hit that like button do not forget to subscribe check out Luke Crate, guys who's my discount code wdsg at checkout get yourself 10 percent off and i want to say thanks for watching i'll see you next Do it for the love, for the love, yes I do So you don't care about the money, well yes it's true And I'm so blessed to be fulfilling my destiny All material things could mean less to me Only thing I ever could need is a Sarah B Sample with a dope ass beat And get the mic check, check all the levels right